Woodland Spirit. We've offended him, Sven. The Woodland Spirit seeks revenge. This here is him saying we've strayed from the old paths. Harold of Fairland. Some monsters are so powerful, local populaces begin worshipping them as gods. Such was the case with the Leshen dwelling in the woods near the Skellige village of Fairland. The elders were absolutely convinced the monster watched over them by defending them from their enemies and training their hunters. The Witcher had his doubts, however. Leshens are mean, self-serving creatures, and the ancient one living in the woods near Fairland was surely no exception. Geralt knew freeing the villagers from their supposed protector's grasp would be no easy task, if he decided to even try. The lesson known as the Woodland Spirit was so powerful as to have mastered the art of marking. This meant the monster had inserted its essence into one of the residents of Fairland. As long as this unfortunate soul remained alive and near the settlement, the lesson would always be reborn near its lair. Yet, even with the marked one eliminated, killing the lesson would be no easy task. The monster commanded the obedience of the denizens of the woods. It could thus call on wolves, ravens, or even the trees themselves for help. Luckily, it had a weakness as well. It was vulnerable to fire, that born of the Igni sign in particular. The Witcher managed to kill the Leshen, ending the murders terrorizing the woods around Fairland. Yet, this did not mean the villagers' troubles were over.